might be the lord of the kaiju rising Throw it right back when I fight you lightning Breaking all the plans when I'm fusing with the lads Yeah, mega kaiju breaking right through It's frightening Ooh, Lost Japan on the bomb Ooh, How these kids crying to their moms Alien heading straight to Fuji when I roll up Scary and eating every human fruit roll up Only four from the three you ain't messing with Hello, we are back with another Kaiju Theater review. Gamera 2 in the trilogy. Gamera 2. Let's talk about this one here as we are talking about Attack of the Legion. So Meteor arrives to Japan unleashing a whole bunch of insects. Bug-like insects that are creepy looking, almost like bugs that are crabs, almost like those Velosa beetles or those uh, dinosaur beetles that you see out there. They have those really weird looking dung beetle claws and chompers in the front. They're really strange looking bugs. This one gets a 7 out of 10 in IMDb. It's a 1997 uh, film. One hour and 39 minutes. What we have here again, like I said, the meteor comes to Japan threatening Tokyo. This is the second film in the Heisei era with Gamera. And basically what happens is these bugs are unleashed and they're unleashed because there is this plant pod that is put through in the middle of the, the city. And these bugs are getting underneath these train stations. Really atmospheric, creepy scenes underneath the train station. Kind of reminded me almost a little bit of like um, classic 70s, 80s horror. And basically they're unleashed and they're going everywhere. And Gamera is summoned to come and help. And basically he tries to destroy the pod. In the process of destroying the pod, these insects attack him and overcome him basically. It's very CGI looking but very creepy at the same time. Very strange. Something we've not seen Gamera deal with in the Gamera films. The bugs completely covering him from head to toe. It looked really atmospherically creepy. You felt sorry for the big guy at one point. He took a lot of damage in this film. Like, a lot. Ayokio Fujitani comes back to this film in the recurring role. Basically, the city now is on the lookout because people are being killed by these insects. As there is a giant mother queen legion that wants to take over and repopulate the area for her insects her bugs so they've got the upper hand on camera in this film and the military of course still thinks it's camera so they start to attack him and realize that after asagi convinces them you know it's not camera then they decide to help camera because camera is very very overwhelmed now, some of the positives of the film, I really liked the atmosphere with the snow. The aesthetic really brought the snow, and it was just a different change of pace. I liked that a lot. The explosions were good. The effects were great. Some of the CGI was a little bit questionable, but not enough to take me out of the film at all. Um, acting was very good. You get to see more action in this one versus more humanistic uh, scenes. The battle was phenomenal towards the end. Um, Gamera, like I said, he was getting effed up pretty bad. And, and some of the gore, you wonder how he even survives. <laughs> this one. And then, of course, there's fire everywhere, explosions. Just a really fun film. Uh, the Legion was a little bit confusing, kind of like a crab looking monster. Ask Casey if, if it was a crab kind of. Mixed with a glow worm or like a dung beetle. It was really strange looking, but very effective. Um, but this movie was great. I did like it a little bit less than Guardian, but this one was good. It was a, it was, it was a fun one to watch. Some people have said this is the greatest kaiju film of all time. I cannot deny that it's good. I liked it a lot. Gamera was very much similar to the previous film in the tri trilogy. Maybe a little bit more work done to him, but... This, this movie was vicious. It had dark elements to it. The acting was good. I really enjoyed this one. Looking forward to Iris. That's the one that everybody's telling me. 
the one to look forward to. But these, the trilogy so far has been fantastic. And I, I like the way the military came to help Gamera in this one and, and the humanistic approach and all that. And uh, a little bit of comedical scenes too. So, so yeah, uh, I enjoyed this one. And let me know your thoughts on Gamera, Attack of the Legion. Thanks for watching. Peace.